Hey, what's up everyone? I'm Leno56 and welcome back to some more Stationeers on Europa. So in between episodes, I actually did go out and do some mining. Uh, I made three mining belts, one for iron, one for copper, and one for gold. And I filled them up quite a bit. Uh, we have a crap ton of iron, we have a bunch of copper, and we do have at least a little bit of gold. So. Uh, we should have plenty of resources to last us quite a while. But yeah, I mainly did that between episodes, and then I also made the three mining belts. But uh, I didn't really do anything else, so it was mainly just uh, a mining trip in between episodes. So what I want to do for this episode is uh, finish putting the, or I guess put the finishing touches on our starting base here, and then I want to get the mining platform up and running so that I don't have to go out and mine ever again unless it's like for ices and stuff but yeah that's my plan as of right now so i think what i want to do is i i need food so i need to hook up everything over here so let's do that really quick okay so how do i want to do this we have a cable coming down like this but i need a cable over here so i think what i'm gonna do is we'll put that there We'll grab you. I'm going to have to make some more cable. Which, where's all my copper at? There it is. Yeah, because there's not going to be any other cable right I guess I could wrap it around like this or something. That, that could work. Alright, let's do that. So we'll grab you, and then we're going to wrap this cable around like this. Probably a waste, but there we go. And then I can even just, oh, I can't do it like that. All right. So we're going to have to do it like this then. Nope. Keep making. There we go. All right. And now you're good. And that we have 16 cable. Okay. Right, now this should be able to turn. All right. Okay. I did put a, a potato in here when I was doing my mining trips and then I realized that this wasn't powered. So just kind of sat in there. There we go. All right. We'll put you in there and let's put the flooring back. And then I can hook this one up too. But, okay, so I want to make a door as well. So let's eject this. Turn you off. And I believe for door it's iron and copper. Which I think all my iron. Is it in here? Yes, it is. Yeah, because I was making all all the all the uh, the mining belts. Uh oh. <laughs> it's lost in between. There it is. Okay. Put you there. Put you there. And let's grab the iron and place you in here. Turn you on and make a door. So I only need one door. All right, and those wind turbines are really going right now. And let's turn you off. If there's any place to shower in front of a window, it's when you're alone on Europa. Yeah, I thought about that too, but I'm I I, I placed a wall there. I, I think the first shower I took was in front of a window, but with my luck, there'd be someone out here watching me, a European alien. All right, and then I believe I need plastic sheets, which I should have. Let me guess, those are going to be outside. Let's 
turn our suit on. And let's head outside. Okay. There's plastic sheets. I, I need to make an arc welder. So I stop using um, our normal welder inside our, our base because that's just going to make pollutants and, and stuff, which is not good for us. Crowbar and one glass sheet. Okay, I, I should be able to do that. Let me guess, the glass is right here. Perfect. All right. And then I need the cable in order to hook all this up. So let's see here. So there's a There we go. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually dismantle this window and wall right here really quick. All right, we're let, let's do it like this. Grab the angle grinder, get rid of this wall, and we're just gonna place it with the normal, with the normal wall. There we are, okay. Yay, our shower. Uh, because everything else is gray, we're gonna spray paint that gray too. And then I'm gonna actually label it. Oh, that is completely dead I, I need to make a bigger battery charger too while I'm thinking of it shower probably unnecessary to do that but yeah we have a shower and my lungs are severely damaged too so I'm gonna have to figure that out as well but yeah our base is actually looking quite nice so I have a bunch of I have 20 steel, that's not a bunch of steel. So what we're gonna do is make as many steel um, frames as, as I can. And then I'm gonna have to make some more, another batch of steel here pretty soon too, because I wanna start working on the mining platform. And these are actually doing really well, our, our potatoes here. So let's decorate the outside of our base while we're waiting. So let's head outside. Besides, I'm going to have to smelt all the ores I have on me anyways. And then I can actually pack these up. Uh, which I completely did not know that you could actually do that. So that's actually really cool. And then I can actually throw these in our uh, recycler or kind of do whatever I want with them. Right, so we have glass out here. We have all this. That's a power controller. All right. So I think what I want to do is place the mining platform over here. So I'm, I'm going to make it level with this. I'm going to have to extend this out too. So. That's kind of my plan as of right now. So we're gonna have to extend that out and then build it out that way. And I'll probably have to raise the ground a little bit because of how they changed everything. So I think what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to make some more steel. So let's do that really quick. All right, so let's get everything ready that we need. And we have another stack of coal. So that's everything we need for steel right there. All right, so we'll throw you guys in here really quick.
And then I think what I'm going to end up doing as well is um, once I get this main area kind of more built, I'm going to just place a bunch of arc furnaces together and kind of have an automatic smelting system. At least until my uh, mining platform gets up and running. There we go. All right, and we have another stack of steel. So what I can probably end up doing now is smelting a bunch of these ores that I have. So we'll do probably a couple of these. Yeah, let's do a stack of 200 iron. That should be hot enough. It is decreasing quite fast. All right, so there's the iron. Place that there. And then let's do some copper. Not sure exactly how much copper I need. All right, that's still smelting good. I can't remember exactly uh, how hot temperature low. it needs to be for, for copper. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, I, I have to go inside and get this taken care of. Ooh, that was close. All right, we'll turn you off. Uh, gold is fine. I'll do gold later. Alright, so we have all of that. Let's see, how much do we have here? We have 10 steel frames. I'm going to need way more than that. Uh, let's see, we have that ends right here. So 2, 4, 6, 8. So that'll be enough for out there. And then I have a, a few steel uh, sheets on me, too. I don't think it's going to be enough by any means. All right. And I wonder if I can smelt a little bit of gold. Oops. There. I will take that. So let's do this. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's going to extend this way, and then the mining platform is going to extend out over here. But, but like, uh, like that. So that's how that's going to work. So I need a lot more. Um, is how I want this to work is I want to build the five mining drills like I normally do. So it's going to be one drill, two drill. So let's do a five by five, six, seven, five by nine. So that's a lot. That's 45. You know what I need? Okay, yep, I will take care of it really quick. Let's turn off my suit so I don't waste anything. Alright, so let's drink some water. We'll eat the little bit of food that we have. And then I'm gonna have to break down my ingots here. There we go. So let's get rid of you guys. Jeez, we have so much stuff now. All right, so I need 90. All right, we're, we're gonna do this. There we go. 
we'll place you there and then we'll place you in here and make 90 or it'll be 45 steel frames and that'll at least give us two uh two uh, mining drills but it'll be and then i'm gonna have to make a bunch of steel sheets and stuff too so while that's doing that let's actually um I got a comment about the ice crusher because it takes a long time to actually melt the ice down. So I'm actually going to write some logic to make it almost instantaneous. Yeah, where's that gold that I have? It's right here. There it is. All right. So I believe I need a logic reader or a logic writer and a logic memory is what I need. And then I'm not entirely sure where I'll, I'm going to place it. Probably over here somewhere. So let's lift up the floor in here. I could probably place the memory right here and then... Oops. I only need one. Or I forget. There we go. I'll probably place the memory here and then the logic writer right there. Okay, that's how I will do it. Place you, place you there, and then the logic writer will go like that. My guy is suffering right now. My lungs are very, very damaged. All right. So let's do ice crusher. And let's do ice crusher. And this is going to be set to 200. All right. So in, we want... Logic memory ice crusher, and then out we want the oh, I have to actually set the lot. All right, how do I want to do that? I need to actually, um, I'm gonna need more cable. I think I know how to connect it to our network because the data port is over on this side and because of all the piping and stuff I have over here, I can't actually connect it. So I think I'm going to have to run it in between the walls and connect it to um, this cable right here is what I'm going to have to end up doing. Let's see, how are you guys at? In... Nine and 20. All right, that should be plenty. All right, so let's do, and then I'm gonna grab my um, my health pill while I'm outside because my guy is breathing really hard right now. Yeah, so that's gonna go like that, okay. And done. All right, let's go outside. So we are going to right there. Wait, how do I want this to work here? Probably like this. There we go. Okay, that should be connected now. Oh, God. I need to place this stacker in, inside too. So let's let's do that really quick as well. All right, so that's hooked up like that. Um, let's grab you, the medical pill, because my lungs are severely damaged right now. Oh, 
peaceful. There we go. All right. So my lungs are good, at least for right now. I'm not sure where I'm going to end up placing this. Actually, right here would have been the perfect spot. But I'll figure it out. All right now, I'm just going to put that right here. So I need a screwdriver and we need to do ice pressure. There it is. And then we want to set this to set in. All right, there we go. So then I don't have any ice on me to, to test this out, but it should almost instantaneous uh, just melt it. I'm not entirely sure how the logic actually works for that, but so then for the ice crusher, um, I don't really know what color to paint these. I guess I could do ice crusher is white. I mean, this is oxygen over here. There we go. Yeah, we'll do something like that. All right, so there's the ice crusher. So that looks good there. Everything else is going quite well. All right, so now what do I need is, oh, you're not done yet. So let's go place some of this outside. Turn our suit on, and then we're going to start placing our mining platform. All right. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. And then I think what I'm going to do is with all the extra space over here too, because I, I don't need this whole area for the mining like platform. I can probably throw like a trader or something over here as well. So then, uh oh, uh, oh, well, that works. Okay. So I don't need, a, I, I don't need a whole lot more uh, steel frames. I do have a couple more over here that I can use. There we go. I need a bunch of uh, steel sheets though. Yeah, you're actually holding quite well, but let's vent you out. And then I think in my main, when I actually make my main base, I'm gonna use the the new active vents that 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 they have. I think that'll be fun to get some bigger vents and move air around a little bit quicker. All right, perfect. So that's that. And then I need 45. So let's do a stack of 30. There we go. That'll give us 60 uh, steel sheets. Which is probably more than I actually need, but that's fine. Oh, and we can actually harvest our potatoes. Well, our potato seeds. All right, so potato seeds and let's harvest our potatoes. Oh, heck yeah. We have 20 potatoes. Oh, that's awesome. All right, and we're good there. So let's plant these potatoes back. And then I think this next batch I'm going to use for the... Um, the water purifier and I did double check it I got a comment saying that you should be able to use coal in this it's charcoal only um, when I tried to use coal it did not work at all so I believe it's only charcoal
There we go. All right. Let's see where. Oh yeah, we have full power too. This is great. All right, so I'm gonna wait for this one to get made, and let's pull you guys out, and let's head back outside. Close our helmet and turn our suit on so we don't end up damaging our lungs any more than we already have. I, I need to make another medical pill too. Alright, so how this is going to work is this is going to come out two, two, and two like that. Okay. So I made a lot more steel sheets than I actually need, but that's fine. I'd rather make more than, than I need. All right. Power low. Yep, I'll take care of it in a minute. The only thing I didn't find while I was out mining was um, silver. And I need silver to make the big battery charger. Alright, so that's all of that. Let's grab the few steel sheets I have in here. Finish up mining this little area. Or mining. Welding this little area. There we go. Alright, so a, little, a few more steel sheets and then I can actually start making the, the deep miners. All right, and let's turn our suit off so it doesn't kill us. And we're almost done. So what do I need for deep miners? You think I'd know this by now? Steel, Electrum, Invar, and Constantin, and the Autolave Tier Two. So that means that I need this. So Steel, Electrum, Constantin, and Solder. Steel. Electrum, solder, and Constantin. So I need one of you. Uh, let's place... I have an extra battery in here that I really don't need. These are extra. There we go, let's do this. All right, now while all this is being made, let's head back outside and finish welding this up. Okay, turn you off and open you up. All right, so let's do this. Uh-oh. Is it empty? Yep, we're completely empty, so this is useless now. Uh, let's go make the arc balder. I was wondering when we were going to run out of uh, fuel for that thing. Happened sooner than I thought it would. Granted, it's been quite a while since we started playing this. Uh, let's see... Arc welder, I need steel, electrum, and bar, and everything I have in here. Oh, oh, well, this is almost done. So once this is done, I'll uh, make the arc welder, and then... I wonder if while I'm waiting, since it's daylight, let's see if I can't go and find a little bit of silver. Because I need just a little bit. I don't need a whole lot of silver. And I didn't find any while I was out yesterday, but... I didn't actually look for it either. Let's see. I think I, I remember seeing silver somewhere. Let's just do a quick pass and see if I can't find any. It doesn't have to be a lot. Because I want to make the big battery charger. 
so then I can start making larger batteries and stuff too and get rid of the, the small batteries. Let's see, I don't see anything yet. There's coal. That's gold. We don't need gold. I have a lot of gold on me right now. There's more gold over there. I can't remember exactly where I saw it. I know it wasn't out this far. I haven't gone out this far yet. Wait a minute. Is that silver right there? Please be silver. Although you're starting to look more and more like gold. Yeah, you're gold. Well, hmm. Let's just kind of go around this way. See if there's anything I can find over here. I think that's gold over here too. Yeah, that is. Um, and that's gold over there. More gold. Apparently there's a floating mountain in the distance. Come on. I need like one ore. That's that that's it. That's all I need. Actually, since we're here, let's grab some ice and see how this ice pressure does. Hydration critical. Yep, and I will be there in just a second. There we go, that's probably plenty. Alright. So we're going to start working our way back. It'd be awesome if I could at least get a little bit of silver. There's cobalt over there. There's lead. I'm not seeing silver anywhere. Please be silver. Yes. That should be all I really need, but we did in fact find some silver. Probably a good thing that's all I need because I don't see any other silver in here. Oh, there's nothing else over here. So we ended up with 13 silver, but that should be all I need. I think I need like five if I remember uh, correctly. All right, awesome. We actually found what we needed. So let's head back, and then we're also going to um, test the ice crusher out, too, since I did the logic. Power critical. Yep, and I'll take care of that in just a minute. We don't have any wind right now, so we're not actually generating any power. All right, so let's head up back inside. We'll turn our vent on. Let's put this away. And let's open our door and turn our suit off. All right, perfect. So I should have smelted the silver while I was out there, but that's fine. I'm, I'm eager to get this working. There we go. Okay. So let's eject you guys. So I need steel, electrum, invar, and solder. And I just need one of you. I think what I need to do is place another stacker right here to keep all the items from going into our, uh, our, our farm right there.
There we go. So yeah, we're gonna do this. Throw that there. Uh, let's make a shoot really quick. Let's see, where's all my iron at? It is right here. So we're gonna throw that there, throw that there. And let's make a single shoot. And then I need to hook, um, hook it up to power. Do that and then cable, wire cutters, boom. And we're gonna push you all the way up to 500 since there's really no reason to do anything else with you. Why does it do that? Like completely drops half the time. Okay, now that that's done, I can make, I can start working on the deep miner. So let's eject everything out of here. We'll turn you guys off for now. And I need steel, electrum, invar, and I don't have enough steel, so I'm gonna have to make some more steel. Which is fine, I have enough resources to do that. Uh oh, uh oh. I really don't wanna damage my, my lungs again, so I'm trying to keep on, on top of it and then I completely forget. Uh, this battery is not gonna last at all, so I'm gonna wait until this is. Actually, you know what? Let's swap this out. Let's do this. There we go. And while we're waiting, let's charge this battery right there. Okay, now let's go back outside. Turn our suit on. And then once this is vented, there we go. And this should last a little bit longer. Four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. There we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and nine. All right, perfect. Wow. So this is all good to go. I'm gonna place two deep miners here, one right here, one right here, and then I'm gonna have three more that way once I extend this platform more. But I just wanna get these initial ones up and running before I do anything else here. Put you there, and since I'm out here, let's smelt this silver. I'm going to do it in here since there's no reason to... Although I do need another stack of steel, so let's do that really quick too. There we go, okay. Close you... That's dropping very, very fast. I need to go inside before I completely uh, lose power, which I just did. There we go. Uh, since you're done, let's put you guys right there for now. And let's head back outside. Turn our suit on. There we go. All right. And you are done. Okay. Right, so we're going to make another stack of 200 steel, and that should be plenty to uh, produce... I think at least four uh, deep miners. 
I'll have to make some more steel. I'll have to do a, another mining trip in, in between episodes or a, lo, a little a little bit of mining during an episode, but I don't want to spend the entire episode doing it. Okay, there's that. Perfect. And... I guess I can use some of the gas that I have here. So, let's smelt some of the gold that we have and then I'm going to smelt a little bit more of the copper as well. Right, and you're done. So let's do some of the copper. That's still plenty hot so I could probably do another two stacks of it even. There we go. So let's close you and and let's vent you. Alright. There we go. Perfect. So we have steel Oh, I put it right on top of that. That was, that was um, interesting. Okay, there we go. So let's vent all the atmosphere out. And open the door. Uh, let's get rid of you guys really quick. Perfect. All right, and then um, I will be right back. So I'm going to pause the game for just a second.
All right, I am back. I went and got some coffee. I, I made coffee earlier, and I was like, I want it because it started beeping. All right, so let's do steel, electrum, invar, and constant 10. So let's do steel, which I only have two. So let's make enough to, so we'll do this. There we go. All right, so we'll do 100 steel. Oops, nope, 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 dang it. 100 steel. I need Electrum, Invar, and Constantin. Electrum, Invar, and the other one is right there. All right, so this should make two deep miners for me. And then let's open up the electronics printer and make the big battery charger. So I need iron gold. Wait, what? Did I make one already? I needed silver for something. I can't remember exactly what I needed silver for. But that's fine since we have all the resources here. All right, so I only need one of the, oh geez. That got made very fast. So let's do this. I'm going to place you there. Where do I want to place it? I could place it. Let's place it up here like that. There we go. So it should keep all that charge. And then what do I need for for batteries? Because I want to do just normal large batteries. So I need one, two, three, four, five, six. So I need six plus an extra five. So I need 11 large batteries in order to keep everything charged fully. So that's 25, that's 50. So I need 55 steel. All right, we'll just do this. We'll just start making a bunch of large batteries for us. And then I can recycle a bunch of this stuff too, now that I think about it. So I'm gonna make a little recycling area. All right, so that's one deep miner there. All right, how's our thriving moderately? Oh. Start throwing you guys in here. And then these smaller batteries, I'm eventually not going to need them at all. So let's just start putting them down here, I suppose. And then I have a feeling I'm going to have to eventually replace all this normal cable with heavy cable. Because I haven't really decided, like I know how I, I want to make my main base. Since I'm kind of have everything here, I could just extend off of this kind of like I did in the first Europa playthrough. Um, I'm not sure how, how I want to do that quite yet. All right, so. All right, that did in fact blow a cable.
Alright, uh, you can stop. Yeah, so I think one of our cables uh, ended up... Alright, let's throw you on top like that. Alright, I'm going to have to pull all of this up. There is a burnt out cable and it's right there. Okay. So... How do I want to do that? Actually, I know exactly how to fix that. Obviously, I'm going to fix the actual cable that burnt out, but there we go. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to build a transformer and place it. How do I want to probably place it right here? Okay, let's do that. That'll at least keep it from blowing. There, that's what I wanted. And then let's do this and like that boom there we go that'll keep it from uh, blowing out in the future so then I should be able to put all five batteries in there and it's gonna charge them a little bit slower but that's fine so if I do this everything's good perfect Two, three, and four. All right, there we go. And then we have some extra batteries here. Those are almost fully charged too, so. So let's see, that's five, six, seven. I need four more. Oh. Okay, there we go. Yeah, so eventually these won't be charging at um, all at the same time. So this is just kind of a one-time thing. One. So let's take a couple of you guys out of here. Charge these ones up. Once those are charged, then I'll throw those other batteries in there. Power critical. Let's see, that's three, five, that's nine. Yep, I need two more. Let's see, how much can I put on one circuit before everything blows? All right, I need one more battery and then we're good to go. And you guys are almost fully charged. There we go. All right, so let's swap you out. Uh, we'll put this one in there first. And you should be done. There we go, okay. And then also, since we're in here, let's test out the ice crusher, since I did uh, get all that. Okay, that actually worked really good. 200. I wonder how much we ha actually have in those pipes. You know what I should do? Let's get everything out of here really quick.
Let's turn you off. Let's see here. A liquid pipe meter. I need iron and copper. I really just need one. So we'll do this. I wonder if I should put some of this stuff in here like that. Alright, so let's place you. We have 52 liters of uh, water in here, so that's a lot of water. So we should be fine on water. Let's see, how are you guys doing? You guys are doing good. Everything else looks pretty good. Let's eat some food really quick. Alright. And let's see, for the deep miners, what else do I need for them? I need 12 steel sheets. So I need 24 steel sheets, 10 cable, and electronic parts. So I need 24 steel sheets, holy cow. There we go, okay. So, wait, where did all my steel go? Is it all in here? Oh no, it's all right here. Wow. Steel. That's that's all the steel I have. Okay. So I need 24, which means I need to set this to 12. There we go. start putting you guys over here all right so this is going to be steel sheets and then I need 10 cable coil which I have although it's th this is going to be um, heavy cable I'm not going to start it with normal cable and then um, have to change it. Then I'm going to start using heavy cable for it. And then I need eight, eight electronic parts. Let's see. I need iron, gold, and copper. Well, I have all that. Actually, where's my gold at? Oh, it's right here. I need to have a dedicated place for everything, so I need eight of these. Oh. Oh, I need 24, that's right. There we go. I was like, wait a minute. Four. Five. Six. Alright, one more. There we go. Alright. That's what we have there. And perfect. Alright, so that's everything I need for the deep miners to actually place them and build them. So let's go back outside really quick. Turn you on, close your helmet, and turn our suit on so we don't end up dying. Alright, let's head back outside. I have a feeling I'm going to have to actually erase the terrain though. Yeah, I'm gonna... Oh, that sucks. So that means I need a dirt canister and the terrain manipulator thing, or whatever it is. So that's everything I need for the deep miners. So, let's see if I remember. I had to do this in, in, in my last Europa playthrough too. Alright, so since these are all charged, let's start swapping these out.
Well, we're gonna do three of them. I don't want to blow our uh, our batteries or our uh, cable again. So I need. It's gonna be in here. Let's turn you off to conserve power. Let's see what's it called? I can't remember what the name of it is. Let's see. Terrain manipulator, there it is. So iron, gold, and copper, which have all that in here. So let's empty this out. So I need one of these. What is that? Toy Luna. I'm going to build a Toy Luna. I don't know why I'm building a Toy Luna, but I'm building a Toy Luna. You know what's funny is my sister's cat's actually named Luna, so. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Basket for basketball. All right, so let's to throw you in come on let me put you in there there we go this should be able to handle four I hope alright and then I need a dirt canister as well so I probably just need one to be fair there we go Okay, if I throw that in here, grab this, let's put this in our backpack. I should be able to go out and mine some dirt and fill this up. I completely forgot to open up my helmet and stuff too, so I just wasted a bunch, a bunch of oxygen for no reason. Oh, thank you, it is nice to be back. Yeah, after my, I lost my first save. I uh, am thoroughly enjoying this playthrough. Alright, let's do... Let's just do this. I believe I can fit like 60 or something in here if I re remember right. There we go, 64. So, how do I want to do this? Probably just do it like this. Oops. Alright, so I wonder if I can throw the deep miner there. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. It'll look a little funny, but that's fine. Alright, let's see here. Can I place you? Jeez. Nope, has to be a little higher, which is fine. Let's just do that. So let's build this up a little bit more. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. There we go. Kind of funny how you have to do that, but if it works, it works. All right, perfect. So now let's do this. And then I need a screwdriver and five cable coil, which I have a screwdriver and I actually have 14, so I should be good here. 
one. And there's two. Then I, I need some electronic parts as well. So let's put you back in our inventory. Let's put you away. And then let's grab the electronic parts. And actually, I think I need the screwdriver for this too. Yep. All right, there's one done. And there's two done. All right, so what I'm going to have to do is extend our mining platform out this way so I can build the other three, and then I can start um, getting everything ready to get this built. I'm going to need a crap ton of chutes, some silos, um, arc furnaces, a bunch of logic, some centrifuges. I'm going to need a bunch of stuff. Uh, I'm going to build it the exact same way I built it in my first U Europa playthrough, and since I know exactly how to build it, it should go fairly quick. So that's that. That looks good. So I guess what I can start doing is working on the other three now, since I kind of know how I want to do this. And then, yeah, we have a bunch of rooms. So um, whatever room I don't use over here, I can make like a, a trading platform or something. All right. Would it make sense to only fully build the first few machines so that can bootstrap so that's kind of what i was thinking too but i'm gonna have to make a bunch of i guess i can start working on it i'm gonna need a bunch more steel um because how i designed it is i need 10 sorters and the five mining platforms spread out like are almost perfect with the 10 sorters that I need one for each ore. So it makes more sense, I think, just to build it all at once and then I can get everything set up. Because the first time I ever built a mining platform on my Mars playthrough, um, I actually had like little baskets where the ores went into, but I didn't want to do that mainly because when storms hit, it just destroys all that. So I, I just kind of want to get everything built at once, I think. Plus I'm going to need all, all the sorters and stuff too. So let's see, I need a bunch of, you know what, let's just throw all this in here and just make a bunch of frames. These are all going to be frames, so we'll have 30 or, 30 or so frames at, um, out of this, so hopefully that'll be enough. See, let's go kind of measure this out a little bit. I'm going to have to make another mining trip at some point, too, and get more iron and coal so I can make a crap ton more steel because I'm definitely going to need it. So let's see. So I believe it's just another... Yeah, it's just another six this way. So it's going to go one, two, three, four, five, and six. So I think what I'm going to do while we're waiting for those um, steel frames is I'm going to kind of do this a little bit. And I bring down this mountain. Hang on a sec. My dog was scratching at my door. I'm like, what are you doing, buddy? Alright, there's that. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I want to bring down this whole mountain right here. I guess what I could do is use the uh, the terrain manipulator, or the, um, the the dirt canister, but it doesn't take that long to fill it up and for what I really need it for. Let's just do this. So let's take out this way a little bit more. There we go. Yeah, this is just going to 
go like this. Oh, that's gone. So we are going to swap batteries out. Like that. Probably doesn't have to be completely flat like this, but that's fine. Half the stuff in here, I'm not even gonna know it's here. So mainly this right here. So that should work. Okay. Sweet. And then I'm eventually gonna build the advanced furnace too. I'm gonna build that in our main base though, which to be fair, I'll probably just replace this base with the main base or like built convert it into our, our main base. Ow. All right, so let's swap you out. Um, you. Let's see, and we'll take you guys and we'll do this. There we go. So I guess what I can do is I can start swapping out all these these uh, tools really quick. I think we have some extra batteries too. Because I already had one in the arc welder. So yeah, we have a, a few extra batteries. Which I guess isn't the worst thing ever. Uh, there's also one in the tablet that I can do as well. So let's throw you in there like that. Oh, that's awesome. We have a bunch, we have a bunch of batteries. At least there's no mountain in the way this time. Yeah, I took I had to take down a whole mountain. That was insane. All right, so that's all the steel. Let's turn you off. Let's turn you off. Try to conserve some power mainly for that. Um, let's drink some water really quick. I'm probably fine on food, but I'm going to um, top it off since I'm inside right, uh, right now. And then I do need to shower here pretty quick as well. We're going to make a potato. Yummy. All right. And I'm gonna need a shower too. My uh, hygiene's getting low. Close our helmet. Wait, why are you guys all messed up? I'm gonna have to close all those out. Okay, and let's do this. I'm gonna need a lot more steel frames than what I currently have. Two, three, four, and let's go this way. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do a a trading platform out in this area too. So then I can utilize this whole area. Oh, that's a storm. So our battery should be fully charged at this point. Or they will be. Alright, so I need more. I need some more steel. So I'm probably going to have to go out on a mining trip during this episode too. Although I'm going to wait until the storm's done for obvious reasons. Alright. Yep, so our batteries are going to... Let's do this. Why are you got why are you guys messed up? I feel like that's this should be lower than where it is. But 
this should be up here. I don't know. But that's fine. I've never seen the toy Luna before. That's funny. <laughs> All right, so now we're just kind of waiting. I can't really do anything right now. Although our batteries are almost fully charged, so we should have plenty of power. Um, let's see. While I'm waiting, I guess what I could do is I could finish decorating the outside of my starter base. Let's make a stack of... Actually, let's... I, before I do anything, this is what we're going to do. Because the minute I jump off the platform, I'm going to have a heck of a time getting back up. So we're going to make some stairs. I need 15 iron. I should have iron somewhere. There it is. All right, we'll grab the iron, we'll throw it in here, and we will make two stacks, or two uh, sets of stairs. So then I don't end up uh, getting trapped. Granted, it's not going to be nearly as bad as what happened on my Mars playthrough. No, so hygiene was added to the base game. Can we finally provide our own fertilizer? Every time I think of that, I think of the uh, the Martian. Um, I don't think we can provide our own fertilizer yet, but yeah, hygiene was actually added to the base game, so I built a little shower uh, right here. Which I guess since we're waiting for the storm to pass, I guess I can uh, actually do that really quick. There we go. Yep, so let's take a shower. La, 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 la. So yeah, I, I, I know that they want to eventually make it to where you have like needs and stuff where you have to actually build a base and live in it. Um, so there's shower and then there's mood. I haven't really seen the mood indicator yet, but the shower one is just very, very basic. Like. It, you really don't need to shower that much. Like it, it affects your mood, which I guess when your mood's down, it affects like how fast your hunger and stuff drops. But it's really just kind of a uh, a simple like little test to see how it works out. Like I really don't mind it. It forces you to kind of build separate rooms and stuff inside your main base, so I don't actually mind. It. And it was easy enough to set up. All right, let's do this, 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 and the helmet. Mining backpack, you and you. All right, there we go. All right, let's go outside. And let's turn our suit on. And I want to make the bigger uh, vents, I think. Maybe I'll do that in my starter base. So let's do stairs with rails right here. Ooh, I'm going to have to make a couple of stairs. All right, that works. So let's see. I want to button this up completely. I want to button this up. I'm going to need a bunch of stuff. So, let's see, how far does this go? So we need... Yeah, I need some more walls and stuff. So I need walls all on that side, this side. A one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Alright, I kind of know how I want to do that now. So we'll probably have some extra iron walls and stuff, which is fine. I don't think I have anything out here, so let's go inside since I can't see anything right now.
And honestly, I can see them making it where we can actually like provide our own fertilizer and stuff. <laughs> All right, so let's do walls. I'm gonna need seven, 14, 17 walls. Cause I have walls on a few things already. So 14 should be fine. Or no, 17. Two, three, four, five. So 17 walls should be enough, hopefully. Um, I'm going to make a bunch of flooring too. So we need seven, seven, 14, 17, 21. So let's do this. I wonder if there's a way, because I had a comment um, not that long ago saying that there's an easy way to set the limit for uh, these printers. He said that he used a stacker. So I wonder if you can set the stack, like the logic, like whatever the stacker is set to is whatever, uh, however one of these get, gets made. I wonder if you get, would be able to do that. So if you want 21 fl uh, floors, you just set this to 21 and it automatically makes 21. I'm gonna have to mess around with that because I wonder if there's a way to use this to set how much you want. Hmm. Ten. And one more. There we go. So I'll put you there and let's head outside. Close our helmet. Alright. So now what I want to do is do this. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm probably gonna have to wait for the um, the storm to pass before I can do the rest. Oh, then there it passes. Yeah, these are all done, so I made extra walls. Oh, that whole area is done. Okay, well, that's fine. So we'll do you, you, you. All right, and then I'm gonna need a bunch of uh, flooring on the bottom too, but I just kind of want to decorate the uh, our base here. And then once daylight hits, I'm going to go out on another mining room, get a bunch of steel that I can, and then um, we'll try to make a couple more deep miners. And then in between episodes, I'm going to go out on another mining trip because it's actually been nice having to be able to actually work on everything instead of having to go out and mine the, the entire time. All right, so I need a bunch of iron sheets. I need 17... 19 iron sheets, I believe, is what it maths out to. Oops. We'll do 18. <laughs> and then some of this I'm going to have to throw in our um, recycler. Which I guess I could do that really quick, too. I could start sorting this stuff out. Oh, that's a wall. So let's throw you there. Um, I have an extra flooring, which I don't really need right now. 
Oh, that was perfect. Okay, so let's go back outside really quick. I don't think there's anything else I need out there. I might need some more windows. I think I have some more windows outside, so let's do this. Those are helmet. And then honestly, decorating the outside like this is completely unnecessary, but... You know what I could do is I could actually finish welding these frames up and stuff too. I don't know, it's fine. Oh, those are all already done. Sweet. So we ended up with a few extra iron sheets. Let's see, and we do have some glass on us, so that'll actually work perfectly. All right, so the outside is for the most part done. I just have to do the bottom part a little bit and then place uh, some supports because this looks kind of funny just floating there. Granted, that's just unnecessary, but it's just little things like that, which I like to do. Uh, I don't think there's anything else in here I really need as of right power now. Out. Let's go inside and swap our power out and then we'll make a couple We'll see how much steel I have. I don't think I have enough steel. I might have to make some iron supports, but I'd rather do steel because steel goes a lot farther. Let's do that. I have one steel frame. That's not going to be nearly enough. So let's see. Daylight is on the way. So I guess I could go out and try to mine some iron and, and uh, hold to get some more steel so I can work on our deep miners yeah because I'm gonna need, need a lot more steel so let's do that really quick so let's get everything ready All right you're good um, let's throw you in here oops helmets closed we'll do that we'll top off our food and then we will head out There we go. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab this. We're going to swap it for the tracker. And then I'm going to place you in here and place you there. There we go. All right. And let's head out. So we're going on a little mining trip, mainly to find everything we need to make a couple batches of steel. So I'm going to need a lot of steel for what I'm doing here. That this is looking good though. So most of the iron I found out was in that area. So let's go this way. And I was hoping to not have to go on a mining trip, but this is the first mining trip we would have actually been on this entire episode, except for the little excursion we took when we were finding silver, which I still can't remember what I need the silver for. So we have it for when we need it. And here's one of the mines I dug. But yeah, I think what I'm going to do is in between episodes, I'm going to get all the resources I need to build and finish the mining platform. Then we're going to work on that um, on the next episode. But I do need a bunch more steel. And there's copper, which I don't really need copper. I don't need silicone. At least not yet. Hopefully by the time I need a bunch of silicone or uh, mining platforms up and running again. All right, there should be iron everywhere. 
there's daylight. That's what I was looking for. Um, I literally walked right past it. Yeah, there's iron up this way. So I think what I want to do is I want to get at least six stacks of iron because that'll give me 400 steel, which should be plenty. Although, I have a feeling I'm not going to get six stacks of iron out of this uh, mine right here. I mean, I very well could, but I have a feeling it's not going to happen. Right, there is more iron this way, so hopefully this is a fairly big node. That'd be nice. I don't think there's any more this way though, so we're going to do this. So let's dig this way a little bit. There is more in this wall over here. Oh yeah, there's more iron right there too. Perfect. have a couple stacks of iron so let's throw that in our iron belt and we're gonna do doesn't look like there's any more iron this way but I'm just gonna double check here all right there is more iron out this direction There's even more in the ceiling here, so we're going to dig straight up. Alright, I don't think there's any more that way, so let's dig out this way a little bit more and see if there's any more iron in this direction. Alright, there's a little bit more over here. I know we have at least three stacks of iron already, so another three and we should be good to go. This is actually going fairly quick too, so this is a lot bigger than I thought it was. There we go. Yeah, one more stack of iron and we'll have it all. So yeah, we this node was definitely big enough. Which is actually surprising because it didn't look that big uh, when I in initially went for it. So let's finish mining out this area over here. I don't think there's any more iron in this direction. So there's a bunch of it right here. What I might end up doing is actually mining all the iron that's in this node right here, because why not? Oh, and there's actually a uh, nickel over here too. I don't really need nickel right now, but I guess we'll have it if we do need it. Well, there's a bunch of nickel over here. 
And this node's easy enough to find, so if I ever need more nickel, I know exactly where it is. Oh, geez. Okay. Um, iron, 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 iron. Pick you up. Yeah, so we definitely have enough iron. I'm going to finish mining out this section, and then we'll go look for some coal. There we go. And then I'm, I'm just going to leave the rest of it laying on the ground. I'm not going to mine anything else right now, at least not in this area. We got all the iron we needed, and that was the main goal. All right, so let's go and look for some coal. Which is almost nighttime, so I'm going to have to hurry. I need a couple of stacks of coal. All right, so there is some coal right here. Wait, what is floating? Yeah, let's get in... Let's go closer to our base so I can at least... I need to see where I'm at. I do know that there's coal everywhere, so I'm not too worried about the coal. Yeah, there's coal right here, too. I know that there's a fairly big node over by our base. So that's kind of why I'm heading this direction. All I need is two stacks of coal. Our batteries are fully charged. We're not actually uh, producing any power right now, but that's okay. Let's see. I think there was coal here at some point. I think I mined it all out. All right. Let's try to find some coal. If not, we did walk past some, so I'm not too worried about it. And I believe there's some right below my base. I'd prefer not to dig that stuff out right there, but... I guess I always can, worst case scenario. Yeah, here, here's a little bit. I don't know how much is actually going to be right here, but... If I can get at least a couple of stacks. Well, I already have one stack, so... I, I, I only need one more stack of coal. So worst case scenario, I have enough for 200 uh, steel. I'd like to get enough for 400, but if this is all the coal I can get, at least right now, then we'll uh, work with that, and then I'll mine in between episodes. I only need like 15 more, which I don't think we have it here, but there is more coal this way, so we should be able to get enough coal to get 400 steel, which should last us at least quite a while, because there's more coal on this mountain up here. And there's actually some coal right here. There it is. All right. And we have all the coal. So let's head home. We're going to smelt all of this. Make 400 steel. And then we will start working on our mining platform some more. Oh, geez. All right, so let's put everything down that I need here. We have exactly six things of iron. 
So that should work perfectly. So we're gonna close you. Let's do one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So this should get fairly hot. Oh yeah, that's pretty hot. And since there's so much pressure, that should last quite a while, I'm hoping. Close out you. Now we wait. Yeah, that, that's holding quite nicely. Right, and that's 300 iron and 100 coal, which should give us 400 steel. There it is. All right, so we're going to throw you right there. Is there anything else I can smelt? Well, I have a little bit of copper. Let's just smelt all the copper that I have. And then let's smelt a little bit of iron that I have left. And the nine gold that I have. Is there anything over here I have? Nope. I guess I could smelt the silicone that I have too. Oops. Oh, that's holding quite nicely. All right, there we go. All right, so let's put all of this in my inventory before I release the gas. There we go. All right, let's go back inside. So that was a fairly successful mining trip. Um, I got everything I needed. I made the 400 steel. I uh, even smelted some other things too, so... Just throw you right there. All right, so how do I want to do this? I, I, I did smelt some iron, didn't I? Oh, it's right here. It's like I thought I smelted everything. So Let's make three more of these. So steel, electrum, invert, and constantin. So I need 150 more steel. So 150 steel, electrum, invert, and constantin. So electrum. Constantin, and I need some, I need Invar, which is right there. So that'll make three more of these, which I have plenty of resources, so that should easily be able to make three of them. Oh. Oh, my light died. That's okay. We can swap it out. Let's turn our suit off while I'm in, in, inside here. All right, so that's going to be a bit before that actually gets made. Um, some of my potato plants are doing good. Others aren't doing that good. I wonder if I need to move these lights. I wonder if that's why they're, they're having issues, because the lights are kind of uncentered. Because the rest of these are doing well, except for... Yeah, let's try that. Let's try to move the lights a little bit more over the... Uh, the actual plants. 
So we'll throw it like right there. And we'll do something like that. And then this is probably a waste of cable, but oh well. There we go. So then it covers the whole area a little bit better. All right, and let's put you back there like this. I was kind of seeing if I could place a light in front of it too, but I can't actually do that. Oh, there was iron in there. <laughs> Because I, I need that cable, right? Unless I flip it around. Hydration critical. No, nah, I'm just going to leave it how it is. It's fine. All right, hydration's critical. Let's drink some water really quick, and then we're going to pop off our food. My waste tank is getting full. What's that? Oops. How are the eggs doing? Alright. I, I kind of wonder if they're going to add toilets to the game. Because we can eat. Like, I can see them doing that. And then, um, like you said, using <laughs> our waste as fertilizer. Kind of like uh, in The Martian. Which I abs absolutely love that movie. And this re reminds me of that. Alright, so we have one already made. We're gonna we're working on the other one. So what I can do right now is let's go outside and actually measure this out a little bit. Alright. So one's going to go right here, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, three, four, two, three, four. All right. All right. So that one's going to go there and then. I need a lot more steel uh, frames. Well, not a whole lot. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Six, eight, ten. Yep, yeah, I need twelve more steel frames. So that shouldn't be terrible. I don't think I have any out here. I have one steel frame inside, so I just need to make a, a few more. Oh, geez. All right. So we're working on our last deep miner. Once that's done, I'm going to make all the steel frames I need. Let's put you in our inventory. Put you in our, in our inventory. Everything else should be fine. You know what? Let's do this. I'm going to throw everything in here really quick kind of condense all of these ingots. And you're just about done. So let's get all of you guys out of here now. There we go, that's better. We have so much copper. We have 316 copper. I guess that's not the, the worst. Uh oh. Our water purifier is no longer working. Yeah, and I can't throw coal in here. Requires charcoal in the import slot to operate. So, yeah, um, normal coal does not work. It has to be charcoal. Which actually, that reminds me. I guess I could place. A, um, a pipe meter right here to see how much water is actually in this waste pipe.
liquid pipe mover, iron and copper, which I have plenty of both. And we are generating power, so that's good. Let's do this. Just place it right here. Yeah, so we barely have any water um, in this pipe. But I guess what I could do is I have a bunch of potatoes. Actually, maybe once I harvest these, I'll throw those potatoes in a recycler to get biomass to uh, turn into charcoal for us. That might not be a bad idea. Okay, so I said I needed, what, 12? So let's set this down to 24. Well, I did that. I completely forgot there was other stuff in here. That's fine. All right, let's do this again. There we go, that's what I wanted to do. Throw you in there and let's do steel frames. I thought I threw them in there. Apparently I did not. Alright, so we want the steel sheets. And then I'm also going to need more steel frames for these supports as well. But I'm not going to worry about that right now. I want to get our mining platform for the most part up and running. Which I should have enough to actually start that. So let's... Yeah, let's do this. Turn our suit on. And. Alright, let's do this. So there's me one, two, three, four. Alright, so it's going to be something like. I forgot the frickin' terrain ma manipulator. Dang it. That's okay. Let's see, how many of these do I need? So this is... Two, four... Six, seven. That's 42. 44, 46. F I need 48. So, 50 steel sheets. Which I can do that really quick. Because I forgot the terrain manipulator. Alright. Yeah, I'm turning you off. Steel. Right, and you're done. So that's actually perfect. Throw you in there, and let's make some steel sheets. Alright. And let's do this. Oh, before I forget the terrain manipulator. Okay, there we are. Now let's head outside. On, on, on. And you are done. Okay, let's go outside. There we go. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight. Ooh, are you empty? You are empty. All right, let's just go and dig a little bit over here and There we go. All right, you're full. Two, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, that should be everything I need for this. All right, so there's the other three deep miners. I'm gonna need a bunch of steel and um, electronic parts and cable in order to complete those, but that's okay. Let's place these down. Three, four, five, six. So we have some, we have two extra. Ooh, actually, we have one extra. There we go. All right, now I need a bunch of steel sheets and then I can um, weld all this together and then I'll probably call the episode here after I end up doing that. We are coming up on the two hour mark here. But we have done a lot this episode, uh, mainly because I was able to go out mining in between episodes and collect a bunch of resources that, that I actually needed. That was my dog snoring. All right, everything else looks good in here. Or, let's see, I'm going to grab an extra battery because I know I'm going to need it. Here, let's do this. Throw you there and we'll throw this battery here. Alright. And let's head out. Oops. All right, let's weld all this together. Shouldn't take too long. I'm actually going fairly quick. Fifty percent. That is not low. Dang it! We were so close. There we go. Just about there. And that should be it. All right, and then I'm, I'm gonna, gonna need 12 steel sheets for each of these, 10 cable coil for each of these, and four electronic parts, and then I can get the deep miners up and running, and then I can start working on everything else, the centrifuges, our sorting system, the silos, the arc furnaces, um, everything else. I need to get this up and running. And then once this is done, I will work on our main base, which I haven't decided if I want to incorporate it into this base and just kind of build around it and eventually replace this, or if I want to build a, a completely separate base and then just kind of keep this for n nostalgia or, or less, since I kind of put a lot of effort in and in worked into this one. But uh, yeah, I'm going to call the episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and I will see you all in the next video.